good afternoon. I am at a rooftop unit. AC is not running. I hear what sounds like the fan motor. Condenser, compressor's not running, condenser fan motor is not running. And it's 93 degrees. Thankfully, most of this unit's actually in the shade. Um, I'm gonna open it up. Here's our fan compartment. I put a new motor in this unit. And uh, there's our condenser side. No fan motor, no compressor. We'll open this up and see what's going on. Okay, so I got the electrical compartment open. Got one, two, three, four, five flashes. Over on the guide, five flashes, low pressure compressor lockout. I'm gonna see, they said they felt no fan running. I'm gonna see maybe if the belt snapped, uh, but I did have pressure here actually. So no, the fan's definitely blowing, but I'll still take a look at the fan compartment. Taking a look at the filters, not clean, but not awful. Uh, I'm gonna see what's up with the pressures now. Okay, so I pulled out the electrical diagram and then went over to the legend, got the low pressure switch, and that is right over here. You can see it's two blue wires going into the control board. There's two O's and two blacks going in as well. So we got two blues, two oranges, and two blacks. And I'm testing now between the two blues because I know that Mike has done this in the past and he has had continuity and it's a board issue. And you could see we do have continuity. I can't make too great of a connection because I'm trying to record at the same time. But we do have continuity, so the low pressure switch is not open. Uh, which means that the board is going to be no good. I'm going to plug it back in and turn it back on and see if we get, uh, if it starts up. Uh, I do have my gauges hooked up just in case, but we'll see what happens. And if you take a look at this legend, it says our low pressure switch opens at 50 uh, PSI. And we're at 200 PSI on the gauge, so... I know that even if it were low, it's not low enough that it, the low pressure switch would be tripping right now after resetting it without the compressor running or anything. It just immediately goes into low pressure switch open. So it's gonna be the board. So I called around at uh, Johnstone and Johnstone has it. So I'll pick it up there tomorrow. I don't have time today, I have other calls and it's a little bit of a ways away, but um, if it weren't for Mike's videos, I probably would have taken a lot longer to figure that out. I wouldn't have known to just check that right off the bat. Uh, it's a 410 system, York, and he's, been, he's had issues with all of these systems non-stop. I replaced the fan motor in this one. Me and Mike replaced the TXV in another one. I replaced another fan motor in one and also a I can't think of a pulley for the fan. But uh, that's going to be it for this video. It's a short video. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed. Comment if you have any criticisms or advice. Like the video if you liked it, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.